staying warm in the early medieval period was a bit of a challenge and cloaks were very popular. But how do you wear a cloak? That's all coming up. Now there's a couple of different ways that we can wear a cloak. The most common way is the cloak sort of drawn centrally over people and a small clasp in the middle. However, this actually wasn't uh, the most popular way during the actual medieval period. So let's find out how to wear a cloak for early medieval reenactment. Alrighty guys, so Jess here is modeling our rectangular cloak. Very well done, Jess. And the way that we wear it is we basically break the cloak into three, right? You um, have it outstretched on this side, you wrap it round and you put a penannular brooch here. We'll talk about this in a second. And then the remainder of the cloak typically gets wrapped up on the side or thrown over your side, entirely up to you. So. Penannular brooch. It's actually a Latin word and it means almost circular as opposed to an annular brooch which was entirely circular. The annular brooches were a bit tricky to use because it meant you have to poke the fabric through the hole and then put a pin in it. Whereas a penannular brooch is a bit different. Penannular brooch. It means almost circular just like this one here. So here's a lovely iron reproduction. And you can see it's open at the bottom. All right. So it's very easy to take on and, and take off and all that kind of thing. As you can see, the, the point is pointing away from Jess. That's really important because if the point was pointing towards her, you might have a jabby thing which goes in your neck. You don't want that. So we don't want to have a jabby thing going in the neck because that can be really annoying and especially if it's made out of iron. So best to keep it pointing away from you. All right. But otherwise, um, these are probably one of the most commonly found medieval items of history. In fact, at the Battle of Wisby site, I think they found over 10,000 of these things. And that represents, obviously, a whole lot of people, presumably, shedding a whole lot of clothes. Anyway, um, but the point is that these were a very common item and, and obviously used very frequently. So here we go, a penannular brooch. It's, it's a really cool thing to have and very functional little item. Doesn't cost very much money, but they're really useful. Alrighty guys, I really hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like, subscribe and share. I'll catch you in my next video.